What's up y'all, I'm Reed the Fishmonger and today we're doing buffalo style snapper wings. First we want to get the scales off. Looking good. This bone, if you could see, moves independently. We're able to slide our knife right underneath that bone and separate the throat really easily that way. Puncture that membrane, slide all the way up. Now if you have scissors, it makes this part super easy. That whole chunk of meat comes right out. Run a knife right in between. Buffalo style snapper wings, ready for the grill. First, we need to make up a quick buffalo sauce. Super easy to do. Frank's Red Hots and a stick of butter. You don't need anything else. You can get as fancy as you want, but this is a tried and true way to make a quick buffalo sauce. And yes, the entire stick of butter. And once it's melted down, we're gonna taste it. Woo, that's good. That's perfection. We don't need to add any more Franks to that, don't need any more butter. She's ready to go. All we need now is to crank up the grill, get it smoking hot, and add our snapper wings on, get a nice char on them, toss them up in this buffalo sauce, add them to the slaw, and we'll go to town. First, we're gonna make an Asian slaw to serve with it. This Asian slaw is super simple, and you can make it with probably stuff you already got lying around in your kitchen. On our cabbage, we're gonna peel off the outside leaves first, cut the butt off. All right, these nice fat pieces are perfect size for the slaw. Now that we've got our cabbage all chopped up, we're gonna throw in some green onions. And now we're going for nice thin rings. So whatever works for y'all. That noise coming in is rain. We're outside cooking right now. Up next is cilantro. Now for vegetables, all we're missing now is jalapeno. When it comes to jalapeno, there's two people, seeds and no seeds. I'm seeds. Sesame oil is super pungent, so you don't need a lot of it. Very fragrant, too much will overpower the whole thing. The rice vinegar, it just bright, refreshing. It adds a needed savoriness. Not much pepper, a little bit more salt than pepper. A Little bit of soy sauce. Whenever I'm cooking, I always just add my ingredients, taste it, add my ingredients, taste it. You can always add more, but you can't take anything out once it's in there. Now we're just waiting on the grill to heat up, get to a high temperature. We're going for about a 450. So that way, as soon as those wings go on the grill, it's gonna be instant action, start charring the outside of the fish. We want a nice, crispy outside before we douse it in our buffalo sauce. A Little bit of oil. Flip her over, make sure you get both sides good and salted. Ready to throw these beautiful snapper wings on the grill. Nice and oiled up, please don't stick on me. Woo! We're gonna close that and let it build up heat. Get a nice char on it. It's not windy out right now, so we could live with leaving it open. But if you got a little bit of wind going on, you want to close your grill so that way the wind isn't cooling off the surface of your grill and doesn't prevent you from getting that nice char. When you're putting your char on your snapper wings or anything you're grilling, it's important not to touch your fish or move it around until you've got those nice lines on it. If you peek at it or slide it around, it's going to prevent you from getting those beautiful grill lines. Let's check in on these guys. Oh yeah. Lost a little bit of our grill lines to the grill. That's why it's super important to gently work your way around and not do it as quickly as I just did. And this guy's ready to come off. Woo! Going right into the buffalo sauce. Now we're gonna take our buffalo sauce and douse it. Get it all over those wings. You guys, you gotta try this. I'm telling you, if you haven't made buffalo snapper wings before, it's a hit every time. 
everyone leaves the party stoked when these things are around. We've got the family and friends going in on buffalo snapper wings. This is cooked to perfection. Thank you. Mm, to die for. You heard it here, y'all. To die for. Well, you guys, thanks so much for hanging out with us while we grilled out some snapper wings. Hope you have a killer day. Catch you on the next one.